All right, so here we have a couple of quizzes, quiz one, two, three. Let's uh, do a find again. And a find retrieves that we have three quizzes. And not only can you can you uh, uh, insert, right, but you can you can also, and you can not only can you retrieve, obviously, right, but you can also uh, delete uh, quizzes, right? Uh, so for instance, to delete a quiz, you you would, uh, again, they all, all the commands start with db and then followed by the name of the collection. And then there is the command that you want to use uh, to operate on that one on that one uh, collection. Now remove uh, if I if I just do an enter, right? It's just going to come back saying that uh, that was an error. There was uh, you didn't give me enough parameters to uh, to work with. Uh, it's it, it's not what you might expect in a relational database where you might uh, a, a, the command might be interpreted as in remove all the records, right? Here is not interpreted as that. Instead, the equivalent of removing everything would be to use here a, you know, a double double curly bracket. Okay, I'm not going to do it, but what that would do is that it would um, truncate the database, right? Because it, it uses that argument, that first argument to that to that function, as a pattern match. Right? It says I'm going to pattern match uh, this empty object with all, all the documents that are in there. Uh, this actually matches all the documents, right? And it's going to remove all of them. So I'm not going to do that. Uh, instead, I'm going to remove the, uh, the object, the quiz, whose title right, is perhaps uh, quiz2. Right, so if I do that, notice that it comes back with a status information saying that, yep, there's one document that was removed. We can do a find again. Right? And notice that indeed quiz two is no longer there. Right? So, so there it is. So the this um this this predicate that we pass uh, in the function uh, to retrieve the uh, to to remove a particular uh, object is the equivalent of using a where clause. Right? Same thing with our finder method. Right? If we provide the a, a predicate here as an argument. You know, we can retrieve uh, only that one element, right? So it's, this is the equivalent of passing a where clause.